Hello students, see this question from just 2023. So in this question, they have given a circuit and they're asking what is the charge on this capacitor when it is fully charged in the unit of CE, okay? So they're asking charge, okay? The capacitor in the units of CE. For that, they are given that these two all resistance are identical, okay? So let us put this resistance are R, 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 okay? Now you can see from here, this figure, okay? This battery is parallel to this resistance, okay? So if I remove this resistance, that will not affect anything because finally the voltage in this point is same, okay? This voltage is coming here. So for example, if I, I uh, redraw this circuit, so I can redraw this circuit uh, like this also. And this will be the battery, okay? Now this voltage is same like this voltage. Okay. So I, I can remove this, uh, this resistance. It will not affect anything in the circuit. So this is my E. Okay. Now what will happen? This current will flow from, from here. And once this capacitor is fully charged, okay, it will not draw any current. Okay. So first let me calculate, uh, the equivalent resistance. So these two resistance are in series. Okay. So these two resistances are series. So this is 2R. So this is basically 2R and not 2R is parallel with this R. Okay. So this will give me 1 by R plus 1 by 2R. Okay. So this will give me 2R. R equivalent <laughs> of these two resistance. So this will give me what? 2 plus 1 that is 3 upon 2R. That is R equivalent of these two resistances, 2R upon 3. Okay. So let me remove this resistance and put a resistance 2R by 3. So this resistance will become now 2R upon 3. Okay. And again, this R is in series with this 2R two, two, two by 3. So this R plus 2R upon 3 will give me what? That will give me. 5R upon 3, okay? So let me remove this resistance also and put a single resistance here. 5R upon 3, okay? 5R, 5 by 3R, okay? 5 by 3R. Now, this says capacitor is fully charged, okay? Once this is a fully charged, there'll be no current will be flowing, okay? So current will flow directly from here to here, okay? So I can calculate now that I can find the current in the circuit, okay? So current in the circuit will be voltage divided by total resistance. Total resistance is R plus phi by 3R, okay? And if I, if I find the voltage across this capacitor, okay? Voltage across this capacitor. So this voltage will be what? current into resistance, this, this resistance, this voltage will be V. Okay. So if I want to find a voltage V across capacitor, that will be E upon, this will become 8 R, 3 R plus 5, 8 R upon 3. Okay. And multiply by this resistance, this resistance is 5 by 3 R. Okay. So this will give me what 3 E upon 8 R into 5 by 3 R. Okay. So this three, three cancel RR cancels. So this gives me five by eight. Okay. Voltage is five by five by eight. Okay. Now I want to calculate the, what is, what is your charge here? Okay. So, you know, the charge of capacitor is given by C V. Okay. So this is, so, so charge will be now what C C C into five by eight E. Okay. And that is five by five by eight C E. So they ask the charge in the unit of C E that is five by eight. Okay. So the B option is the correct option for this question. Okay. Thank you very much.